Hello everybody and welcome back to Might and Magic Duel of Champions. And hey, let's let's start with a with a little bit of news. Well, first of all, if you haven't checked out the gift codes last week, then here's a quick reminder. You should have a code down here. Whether it's the same code or maybe you'll have a different one. I'm pretty sure these are like universal for for everyone. But the second thing we can see here is that apparently now every Tuesday and Friday we're gonna have a one no no, no come come back here. We're gonna have a premium cars in the Infernal Pit. Which is fairly strange in my opinion because currently at this moment because I've just checked we have a premium card in there but yeah on Tuesday there will be Shogun available and on Friday Nuburu oh wait actually Tuesday was yesterday wasn't it yeah but actually um, the funny thing if I'd go to uh, Infernal Pit right now it has a premium card available and it's actually grounded. I think I have some of those somewhere. Though it's gonna change in like roughly 50 minutes. Well, a little bit more than, than 50 minutes, but yeah, it's more or less 50 minutes. And I'm curious because if we have like those premium cards now in the. Um whatever it's called, in the in, in the Infernal Pit. How it's gonna work in the future? Is it like we're gonna have some... I mean, is it is it gonna be like that they will stay for the entire day? Or... Or there will be no more... No more cards in the, in the, in the Infernal Pit than one a day? Or however it's gonna work. Actually... Um, I'm thinking about trying to get this Nubaru Color of Twilight, the shiny premium version on Friday. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do it. I may, I may not. I'm not entirely convinced about the Sanctuary, so we'll have to see about it. Definitely. Though he's a, he's a fancy, he's a really fancy Sanctuary hero, so... We'll see. Anyway, enough of the bullshit talk, and let's get to playing. I have like nine, nine minutes of the gold boost remaining, and this is insane because it's like... In the past week, I've got like... I don't know, like four gold boosts already. Like, day by day, I was always getting gold boosts on the... Um, I was always getting gold boosts on the on the daily rewards, so I probably have uh, a lot right now, and I'm just not spending them. It's like probably uh, the game is trying to tell me play more, play more. Anyway, I'm playing right now, and what we're gonna do? We're gonna go for spells. Spells time. Yeah, actually, I was gonna say spells time, bitches, but uh, at the very last second, I started thinking: Is it entirely appropriate to say this last word that I haven't said? Anyway, uh, I'm also thinking about maybe trying on the tournament. I'm not sure whether I'm gonna record it or or try to do it on my own. But it's like I'm slowly getting to 100 tournament tickets, and yeah, <laughs> probably if I if I'll get to 100 tournament tickets, I'll I'll start to think about these tournaments. What do we have here? Format standard. If it's standard format, it's nice. It's, it's fair enough. I I can live with it. Interesting. 
But for the time being, we're pursuing the Spellmaster quest. That's why I'm choosing the Spells deck. I have solid 29 spells here, totally no fortunes. Let's go. This may end up really bad. This may end up really well as well. Am I going ranked? Yes, I'm going ranked, so... It's risky. It's like, I, I don't really want to promise anything right now, but... Maybe if I'll have a little bit of spare time over the weekend, probably, or something... I'll probably try to use up some of those gold boosts that I have stashed. And maybe I'll try to... Get somewhere around the... Champion rank. Oh no, wait. Um, I think I'll have the... Whatever it's called. Um, because I'm knight right now. And the next rank is... It's Commander, I think. Yes? No? Yes? Am I right? Am I wrong? Hmm... She's pursuing magic. And to some extent this worries me. Let's try with a quick assault with a lingering ghost. Um, so yeah, don't, don't expect the uh, the usual necropolis setup on this one because, well, yeah, this one's different. This one's very different, and this one's armed with four bone yards, as far as I'm aware, as far as I recall. As far as I can tell, or whatever. Hmm. I cannot drop him. Not just yet. Nor I can drop Hasha Hasha Fash. Hasha Hasha Fash. Uh, permanent. Enchanted creature gains Uncord. Prevent all damage dealt to enchanted creature when ice. Uh, uh, when damage is prevented this way, destroy ice shield. So I may as well increase my magic and drop that thing and attack. Actually, I don't really recall all of those spells. Like, for example, what's this one? Permanent. When enchanted creature dies, deal 2 damage to its controller's hero. Wonderful. So I can use it to sneakily hurt my opponent. Actually, I'm not entirely sure who am I facing today. Let me see. Svetlana, hero font of the Spider Queen. Take target vampire creature card with uh, might. With uh, requirement of three might or less from your graveyard and deploy it for free. Okay. Fair enough. Mm. At this particular point in time, I should increase my might and block her Sea Elf Archer with my Untamed Wraith. Wonderful. And continue attacking. Yeah, she'll hurt me for one. Oh my god. With this particular deck, I should pursue the High Magic build with this withering. Oh, the spire thingy. You son of a bitch. And regenerating tree. Uh, show me the thing. Cannot attack, regenerate one. Creature melee plant. Incorporeal. So, no magic damage dealt to that thing is halved, rounded down. Wonderful. Hmm. I'm thinking. 
because my untamed wraith will become useless any second now. Uh. Show me that thing. Uh, crippling, whenever this creature deals attack damage to a creature. Which means that if a creature cannot deal attack damage, then it can't cripple. So you wanna do it the hard way? Let's do it the hard way. And the turn. Uh, these are the icy weapons. Icy weapon. Permanent enchanted creature gains plus three. Wonderful. That is a lot. Oh my god. Oh, I could so totally use like some sort of nuking bomb thing here. Hmm. Now let's see what we got. I have the Shared Agony. Enchant creature permanent. Whenever damage is dealt to your hero, deal that much damage to enchanted creature. Sort of bullshit. Um, <laughs> though I could wither his freaking Arc Lich and render it totally useless. Oh my god! Oh my god! Now I remember uh, why I hate Necropolis and Crippling so much. Like, yeah, Bastard is totally lost. He can't do a thing about it. I'm trying to avoid wasting hush hush a fash. Wait, no, 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 no. Um, because uh, it's not Atropos, it's Hashafash. What's what's Hashafash ability? Whenever Hashafash chosen of shadows attacks and destroys a creature, deploy a token that's a copy of that creature under your control after the attack. Wonderful! I've nearly forgotten that he's so useful. And you know, empower him with plus 3 attack from icy weapons he becomes overpowered yeah there's probably like one thing this deck really lacks and it's a uh, I wonder what was that for? Um, yeah, as I was saying, uh, one thing that this deck really lacks... Um, damn. Is a totally overpowered... Um, Thinking becomes difficult. If I'll enchant my ghost with this and cast this on a tree, this is like a total of six.
wonderful. Now, these two are like literally no threat to me at all. I cannot move that thing, because fuck me, that's why. But this thing can attack. But what we're gonna do down there? Down there we have to block. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, of course, because it's a uh, freaking spire thing. That's even worse. And I think it was some sort of a uh, chain lightning or something like this. It attacks an empty battleground position and kills me, as far as I'm aware. My god, crippling is so nasty. Um, yeah, show me this spire thing. Creature at soul spire at soul spire dies from combat damage. Destroy soul spire. Okay. Um. At this particular moment in time. Oh, wonderful. Permanent enchanted creature cannot be targeted in gains plus one and plus one. Uh, he's got life drain too. That's way too much. Way too much. This is... This is definitely not an easy deck to play, honestly. Haha, he failed! My trap was freaking successful. No, I can deal with it. I can deal with it. Yeah, I can use... Um, I can use this Lingering Ghost to attack him. Then I can empower this lingering ghost with the ice shield and get rid of the freaking dude. This it deals three damage, right? Yeah, to enemy hero when it dies. So this is really bad. Or I could just smash that thing for four damage and But wait, it's if during opponent's turn. So it doesn't matter how, it matters when. I see. 
Um, Magic Melee Human Wizard. Magic Melee Human Wizard. Plus one, plus one, and cannot be targeted. And it's permanent. So it will cost me three. I'll have five left. And I think I'm gonna drop Hashafash up there. Or should I six, seven, eight? Isn't it wonderful? No, it's not. To deal with the vampire. I need something with a lot of attack. How come it died? I don't know. Um. Let's try it this way. I'm not entirely sure why the thing died. Oh, I see. I failed. Yeah, if I were to use the um, Shared Agony, I could have, for example, wrecked him. That's a really unpleasant situation here. <laughs> Enchanted creature gains plus three. Whenever enchanted creature attacks, it deals damage equal to its attack to its controller's hero. <sighs> but he is sharing agony. So if I'll use these on um, this thing, I'll have it grinded up to 5 attack. That's a lot. I'll kill him, I'll kill him. I'll deal 5 damage to myself. Or I could use this and attack her for 6. Do it or not. You know what? Let's do it. <laughs> I'm crazy! I am freaking crazy right now. This is gonna be insane. This is fucking madness. Tell me you're a vampire. No, you're a skeleton. Damn. 
Though this is a vampire, so I don't really care about the vampire ritual, ritual altar here. All enemy creatures on the same row gain minus one and minus one. It's not that non-vampire creatures gain minus minus. Hmm, that's bad. Ah. <sighs> No, 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 no more. Oh, a Grave Warden, hello. What is this spell? Enchanted creature is immobilized and gains fortune ward. Okay. I'm gonna increase my might. Grave Warden can shoot. Oh, shoot. Mm. This thing cripples. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna... Put one here. Put one there. Attack. And... And the turn. This is this is this is really um, tricky situation because <sighs> I'm playing here with what is essentially a weakened deck. It could have been really powerful, but it is weakened for no apparent reason. Oh, Athropos. He may be a problem. No, not the Death Seal. Son of a gun. Hmm. I'm not sure if the creature from the Boneyard can attack instantly or not. At the end of your turn, okay. <sighs> Let me draw a card. Oh ho ho. Hello, hello. Whenever enchanted creature attacks, it deals damage equal to its attack to its controller's hero. Hmm. 
I failed. Yeah, given my current strategy, I failed. Though it's um fairly okay. I'll do this, I'll do this, I'll do this. It costs one, it costs four. Let's do it. And let's end the turn. Oh, very, very sticky situation. As I said, I'm playing with something what's essentially a weak deck. Uh, and as I said before, it's like I was never serious about this deck. When I was building it, I was more like, oh yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll, we'll see, I don't really care that much. We'll see however it turns out to be. Huh. A vampire ritual altar. Interesting. This is difficult. Sorry. I'll get this thing wrecked. To heal my vampire. No, stop. It's not good time for a pressure. Um. You move there, you move there, you go here, you evacuate. Okay. I'm not entirely sure why I did it. Apparently I just wasn't able to... Oh, magic shooter of course. My bad. Apparently I wasn't able to shoot that thing, I don't know why. Hmm. 
<sighs> and I need more cards. How come she still got like five, six cards on her hand? Why I have one. This is bad. This is getting worse and worse and worse for me. <sighs> and even though I had a fairly good start. The ending sucks. Okay, 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 okay. Um, draw a card. It's a vampire. Good. Um, What would be worth getting ice weaponized? Hashafa huh. to have a total of a lot, roughly five. Oh, come on, you son of a gun! Wonderful. What the fuck? Gosh, darn it! It's like I hate this pressure of a time. Oof. This is bad. This is really, really bad. <sighs> Arc Lich, that's good. I mean, um, Neophyte Lich. It's good anyway. Uh, now I'm gonna get wrecked so badly. How come she has so many fucking cards? This is this is like the only thing that bothers me. Nothing else bothers me but the fact but the fact that she has so many cards. <sighs> While I'll lack them. No, 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 shit. This sucks.
Draw a card. Ice Shell. Wunderbar. What have I done? Oh my god, what have I done? <sighs> okay, screw the nether. I'm in such an awfully bad situation right now. Yeah, he's gonna move. Oh, that's bad. And like some sort of super overpowered Namtaro thing. <sighs> Why is that thing so overpowered? Oh, wonderful. I failed. I should have used the anvil. Oh, wonderful, I have the Athropos.
Yeah, I wonder if I can copy that thing. The only problem with this whole situation is that she has way too many cards and this duel is getting way too long. And she can spawn vampires for free using her skills. Oh, of course, that's how Hashafash became so powerful. I mean, that's how... Uh, Athropos became invulnerable. Not sure that it works this way. Yes, it does. Interesting. Hmm. Draw a card. Wonderful. Ah, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the Oh my god. This is so painful. Uh No more. By the gods, no more. Never ever again. Yeah, I suffer. He's gonna... Ha! He cannot cripple Hashafash. <sighs> yeah, and I'm just sitting here, suffering. Of course. Ah, interesting.
<sighs> when enchanted creature dies, deal two damage to his controller's hero. <sighs> no mother fucking way. Well, sir, if I'm right, he's got three attack. And now, sir, good game to you. For now, you're dead. Yeah, I'm just gonna sit there and enjoy the fact that I can attack so much and still win holy shit daily quest completed spellmaster I don't remember oh my fucking god 46 minutes of a duel. Yeah, honestly, I don't remember when was the last time I had so long duel. Oh my god, I'm... Uh, oh my god, this was so stressful. So difficult. So... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. I hate it. <laughs> ah. <sighs> this is yeah I have like 19, 19 boosts left this is like the most strange overpowered ridiculous thing in the freaking world it should not happen ever because this deck this deck its intention was to be a bad deck if I were trying, sorry, if I were trying to build a good deck, I would never be able to build something that is so freaking overpowered. But I was building like a lame deck just to finish the quest. And when it comes to finishing the spells quest, it works brilliant. What, did I get like only 2% towards the um, progress of the thing? Was my opponent like some sort of super low rank or something? Well, I think this is, this is the way to check your opponent's rank. Yes, my opponent indeed was like an awfully low rank. Um... Yeah, I think this is Recruit, uh, Squire, I have the Knight over here, this here is Commander, next is Lord Commander, nah, here, Commander again, next is, uh, again, Commander, next is Champion, one champion, two champion, three. I may be wrong. I wonder why am I dueling like people with such a rank? What what sort of an event it was? Oh my god! No, I can. I can still hardly believe that happened. Seventeen turns. Yeah, the last similarly long duel it took 21 turns though it was shorter in duration because it took only 40 40 minutes um, 12 16 so I guess it means 16th of the December last year though yeah 46 minutes long uh, 46 minutes long uh, yeah 20 20 something half an hour it's 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 fairly decent but this long 
Oh my god, this video is gonna be rendering forever. That's like a note to self. Nope. 43 minutes. Does it count? Like, yeah, this one had 40, but 43 minutes. It was on the 11th of um, um, July. And anything closer to 46? Uh, I'm not sure if it's gonna be like the longest duel in the history of my duels. No! I found something longer, it was uh, a year ago. Over a year ago. 13th of uh, January. 2013, I assume, or it may have been 2012. Oh my god, so many lost duels. Lost, 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 lost. Though, this is strange because here I have like the um, increasing percentage, so I must have won something. Maybe it's just because they are so old it doesn't recall whether they were won or lost. I actually wonder what's this um, this picture here. I think on the winning one it's the Griffin Legionnaire, but the dying one, I'm not entirely sure. Oh my God, that's that's just too much, way too much. Oh. By the gods. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this ultra freaking long and yet exciting, unbelievable. I have to make some super duper ultra title for the video so it can get like cabajillions of views. Uh, but that's oh my god, I'm so tired. Oh, so stressful. By the gods. Oh, I I, I assume that there are probably like a a, a few minutes long gaps where where I'm just so stressed staring at the board that I wasn't even saying anything oh god oh god I need a break <laughs> oh my god I hope you enjoyed and and I'll see you next time but honestly I'm not playing with this deck anymore no more no more Take 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 care guys. Have a have a good time.